what the deal everybody welcome to too rich to miss unscripted today is friday and oh man it is friday tgif right well but in the world of crypto it's always something going on in today's show uh, we are going to be going over some of the news and news and tools that you can use and i know i'm going to be sounding like a broken record but uh the market is prime to get is prime to be doing some wonderful things now but before we get started let me uh, go over a few little housekeeping items here be sure to check out the podcast every week uh, we have another great episode that's going to be coming out for you tomorrow and we have some other interviews that's coming out uh, that's in the pipeline coming out uh, next in the next couple of weeks as well over here working and building as you can see we have merch available right now available uh, as well uh, so if you go uh, right over actually if you go over to our website go over to my website richardhawks2.com or actually you can go over to southernurbanvoice.com and that'll get you over there and there's a link for merch and that'll get you right over there uh, or if you can see it right there uh, in the in the link right there as well you can get it there uh, we have in white and we got the uh, the black and gold as well uh, so yeah definitely do go through and check out and get the merch um, I have some that's on the way uh, to me uh, right now as we speak uh, so you'll see me uh, rocking the too rich to miss brand and from the unscripted ones which i have those as well i just don't have those up on the screen uh, i have the unscripted ones as well and also you are listening to the southern urban voice i am the hottest voice in crypto uh, and if you want to book this voice i am available for you uh, you can go over to richardhawks2.com or you could go over to southernurbanvoice.com and that will get you over here as well all roads lead to the southern urban voice the hottest voice in crypto uh especially um yeah the hottest voice and sexiest voice over in crypto right now uh so now uh so if you did want to go through and book me or get any of my uh services um we can go through and talk we can definitely go through and talk about it you can book me right there on the site and uh, or you can just send me a message i'm available all over social media now in the event that you wanted to get me to specifically just speak with you and help you uh, kind of unwind all of the crazy things that's going on in this world of crypto when you want to get started out the right way i do have consultations that are available and you can go through and just uh hit up my calendar my uh, link right here uh, calendly.com slash forward slash too rich to miss and uh, links and all of that will be in the description below as well so let's go ahead on welcome to too rich to miss unscripted with your host the southern urban voice mr too rich and this show is about providing you with cryptocurrency and digital asset news education and tips that you can use as you take this wild and exciting journey into crypto and as always remember the only real color that matters is green let's get it all right everybody welcome to the show welcome to too rich to miss unscripted let's hop right into the markets here and as we can see oh it's a wonderful day to be in the markets today got a little pump going on all across the board you know we got some green going on uh bitcoin is up about four percent right now as of the recording of this video and it's over that critical eleven thousand dollar mark which is always a wonderful thing to see we haven't really got uh we haven't really got parabolic just yet i mean four percent is cool you know i mean uh five percent is four percent is cool five percent is cool but this is crypto that's just a little something something uh but it's all in it's a good thing going in the right direction uh but bitcoin up four percent looks like ethereum is up 5.67 percent uh and then we got um a variety of things when we look over into the altcoins that we got going on over here 
uh, these stable coins, USDT, that's a stable coin, USDC, that's a stable coin. But all of these others, for the most part, over in the altcoin forest, got a lot of green going on today. Uh, so the most uh, most people's portfolios are going up and going in the right direction. So let's get into our first article. And uh, as we had already talked about that, uh, let's go over here and talk about Patricia. Now, I thought this is a really good and inspiring thing because what we have to keep in mind with this cryptocurrency market, what's happening right now? There are a lot of opportunities that are available for those that are that are thinking outside of the box and that are actually trying to solve a problem. Now, let's go down and let's talk about her for a minute. Crypto payments company wants to usher Africa into a new digital age. A Nigerian business that had humble beginnings as an e-commerce startup is now offering Bitcoin payments to hundreds of thousands of people. Now, this is really, really interesting here. Now, of course, you can go through and read the whole article and all of that. And uh, let's get through and I'm going to tell you just the gist of it, because what happened is the founder of this company, they they solved the problem and they use cryptocurrency and blockchain to solve that problem. And now this company is exploding. And and obviously, since their company is exploding, the founders of this company are benefiting financially from that. I said that to say this, cryptocurrency is a baby as far as the industry is concerned, and there are still so, so many opportunities that are floating around in your situation that you can look and find a need and fill it, and you may have hundreds of thousands of users using your product or service as well as Patricia is and I this is and obviously all of the articles be linked over on my Twitter feed at too rich to miss uh, so you can definitely go through and read this whole article here and check that out Patricia that was a really good really good thing here and that's a good article that uh, some of the other youtubers may not cover because it doesn't shield their coins <laughs> that they're uh, that they're getting paid to shield and I don't have a problem with that I mean if you have a six-figure following uh, you have to feed the beast and a lot of people don't want to take the time to DYOR because it gets to be kind of boring and Also, the one thing that I know I did not pull up over here to talk about one of the reasons and you know I always I talk about the crypto the Bitcoin uh, Bitcoin uh, being digital gold and all of that and I know we always uh, I always talk about Oh, the other company that put in 400 and some million uh, over here. And and of course, yeah, MicroStrategy. I always talk about MicroStrategy, but we also have Square. I mean, and this is not a new this is not a new news story. Everybody in crypto has already been talking about this. Everybody in the crypto news space has been talking about this. But I definitely only want to point it out because it shows a pattern of what's happening here. Uh, you know, cryptocurrency is definitely getting an infusion of capital from the institutions and from smart money. This is a, these are just the ones that we know about. You know, and there's a website that I did not pull up that shows you these. They're, these are just the ones we know about. We don't even uh, uh, there's quite a few that I'm sure are still under the radar that we haven't even seen and noticed just yet. So the whole point and why I bring these articles up and talk about this and why it's important to talk about Bitcoin topping 11,000 for the first time in almost three weeks is because it provides <laughs> I mean, it's uh, it, the writing is on the wall. This thing is going to pop and explode. All, a lot of these tragedies and these bad news that's been going on is priced already priced into the market. And since this stuff was already priced into the market, 
you're not going to see Bitcoin prices move too much. But once the mass, once the mass retail investors start to understand what has been happening and all of the rest of us start to flow in here, in addition to all of the other uh, institutional money that still hasn't, you know, where the effects of all of this other institutional money hasn't uh, really taken hold just yet because there's only a limited supply of actual bit of actual real bitcoin so once these exchanges start to really get in short and start limiting the amount of bitcoin that they can that they're selling us because they may run out because the institutions are buying it up and then you have to go and trade this paper bitcoin uh which i, I i'm i really don't mm, i prefer to get the real thing uh you know but anyway uh, once uh the supply the real supply shock starts to really hit the market is what i'm saying here when it comes to bitcoin you're going to really see some serious things going on price wise so all of that spiel has been to say uh dollar cost averaging don't miss the opportunity going and uh, uh going to catch bitcoin now while it's still low now a real interesting thing uh moving on to the next article here christie's auction house sells nft crypto art block 21 for over a hundred and thirty thousand dollars now i found this to be really intriguing now number one uh the whole digital arts the whole digital art and nft space is really interesting to me now i like the technology because the you know obviously i like the technology but when you're talking about an nft you're talking about a non-fungible token right so to make it as simple as possible you're talking about one of an original one of one right so uh what they're talking about with this one is an auction house that normally sells just your regular traditional art sold a digital portrait of bit of the bitcoin code block 21 for over one hundred and thirty thousand dollars, making the first time a non-fungible token was auctioned at a major auction house this is good as far as mass adoption is concerned and to help with really getting uh getting out what's happening but um i i i don't get it uh, i mean i like art and i'm a fan of art as far as for decoration and such but um and i like art from an investment standpoint you know um i'm i'm going to play around in this nft space uh i'm going to go on rari and do some things and all of that but uh but that's strictly from a speculation point uh, this I just thought it was really interesting. Um, yeah, the one hundred and thirty thousand dollars for this circle right here. Um, so yeah, at, with the Bitcoin code in it. Uh, so yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's yeah, the, lots of things going on in the crypto space. Which and that's another, and it goes to my original point. Uh, it goes back to what I was saying before. There's all type of opportunities over here. You don't necessarily have to be a trader. Uh, you don't have to be a trader to make money in this market. You don't have to be an investor in this market to make money. Uh, you could be Patricia that find that creates a business around blockchain and blockchain technology to fulfill a need that she saw. And uh, uh, you could be the artist that that jumps into the non-fungible token space and creates uh digital art that people like and that someone is willing to pay a hundred and thirty thousand dollars for uh you you know there you may be the programmer that goes through and is writing the code that is supporting these many platforms and these many projects that are out here uh going on right now uh, there are so many different things that you can do in this particular crypto market or if you kind of just want to sit on the side uh, and just kind of enjoy 
all of the green because when the chart and the heat map is green, uh, that means your investments are green as well. So your bag should be looking uh, really good on a day like today. Uh, so and as and like I said, I like the market how it looks on even on the red days. The red days mean you buy, which means on these green days, uh, you already got your bags packed and you're riding and you're riding up the nice little uh, the nice train with the moon bags, right? All right, so uh, we are going to cut that and leave it at that for today. You know we like to keep these videos short. Shout out to the <laughs> to the 95% of you that are running across my videos in the search engines. Uh, thank you to the algorithm for that as we're talking about educating people here in the digital asset space and in cryptocurrency and giving you the news that you can use from the hottest voice in cryptocurrency, the Southern Urban Voice. Be sure to check out the website at www.southernurbanvoice.com if you want to get this voice uh, for any reason and to get my voice on your next project or your next podcast. Or if you need your podcast edited, or if you need uh, any type of audio production at all, uh, just uh, hit me up. I can get you done and help you out with that as well. That's going to be it for today's episode. Be sure to always keep in mind, DCA is the way, and the only color that matters is green. <laughs>